everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to try and create a calculator using React.js and a Bard. So let's get started. I'm going to write a prompt, create a simple calculator using React.js. Let's wait for the response. And yes, we got the response. It looks good. We also have a reference from where the Bard provided us with the data. Let's copy this code. So let's go into our app.js, I'll paste the code here and save it. We're seeing some warnings, but let's ignore them for now. As you can see, we have number 1, number 2, and some operators. Let's test the code. S, let's try entering 10 and 20 and perform addition. Okay, we got an error saying unexpected number. Let's see what the problem is. Okay, I found the issue. In the select, there is no onChange method and operator is not getting assigned. Let's try again. Now we got the answer for 30. Let's try subtraction. Multiply and divide them. We also have to give default value to operator otherwise for the first time it will give us error. We noticed that we can't use the entire code from the Bard. We need to make some changes and verify it. So, that's one limitation of using the Bard but it will definitely improve over time and provide tough competition to chat GPT. Now, let's try adding some styling to the code. We'll ask the Bard to add some CSS styles. Bard added some inline styles and also gave us code snippet that we can use in our style.css file. Let's copy this code snippet and paste in our index.css. It looks better now. Though we can use other tools like Material UI for better styling, this works fine for now. Also, it's working as expected. Let's move on and add styles to the buttons as well. We'll ask the Bard to add more styles to the buttons. Great, they added some styles for button tag. We can copy and paste code snippet in the index.css file. Now it look much better. Now, let's add some styling to the input and select drop down as well. Let's ask the Bard to add more styles and inputs and drop down. They provided some code. Let's try it out. Yep, they added some rounded corners to inputs and select drop down and it looks good. I'll be posting more tutorials on how the Bard works and giving reviews about it. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel.